Do you guys know what dopamine receptors are? No? Oh, okay. Dopamine receptors are receptive to deception if it ain't coming from the right substance. If we understand the anticipation of the devil who's patiently waiting, like your server at your favorite place to wait in, quarterback in every move, let alone setting you up for an interception, and just like that, boom, the enemy crept in. So listen up, I'm speaking up to all my kingsmen, even my women, because I don't want to say this again. Be careful when you get hit with your greatest temptation. Now, this is something that most people probably don't deal with and most people probably do deal with, so there's no need for conversation. If I had vomit to serve, would you play it like a dog who returns to its own in Proverbs 26, 11, as it's stated? Now, don't debate the situation because our master called us to pay attention. But if you have any idea what I'm about to mention, then please seek repentance. Now, it goes like this in 1 Corinthians 10, 13. No temptation has overtaken you such as is common to man, but God is faithful, who will not allow you to be tempted beyond what you are able, but with the temptation will also make a way of escape that you may be able to bear it. Now, this is what you call merit. This is a touchy topic. Do not debate with the master of whether you should master this debate because of your ill desire to mask your baby. Just like the enemy who masks his bait, that worm on that hook with that invisible line, don't be so quick to take or else you'll be the next piece of sushi in line. So please don't be that guy because the kingdom is like a merchant seeking beautiful pearls. Don't be that bad one when they're just gathered to be tossed and hurled. Now, if you really looked at the things that you did do, or you should do, you need to pull back like a 4-5 with a 2-2, or you might just end up pulling back like a 4-5 with a 2-2 because it's afraid to go pew-pew at the sins that compel you. But when you hear it coming from the pew who your pastor stands up on that stage and tells you something that you need to do, repent of your sins and don't play, but yet it's so hard to understand the concept because we have paved our own way. But see, this may be so deceiving that when you walked in, you didn't even see Eve in the meaning of this evening that you came into when you realized that the sin that we came into was insinuated by the things that Adam and Eve did do. But remember what the Lord did do with the flesh and the sinews that came upon the dead bones that were dry, whom it was revealed to Ezekiel that the Lord will renew and multiply. Now for every season, there must be a reason Winter, spring, summer, and fall, there was one sower, one farmer, one person. Through it all, he is my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, and I hope he can be yours too. He is the one and only one I look to. So as I end this spoken word, I just want to say I hope the Holy Spirit has penetrated your heart to reconsider your ways. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.